This week on Threadbanger, I'm taking this old shirt and turning it into an 8-bit masterpiece. Beginner. The first thing you gotta do is decide what 8-bit design you wanna use. I'm going for some extra life, but there's a ton of options. You could do Space Invaders or Skulls, maybe a little bit of Nyan Cat action. Then you get yourself some label paper. If you're planning on doing the heart, you're gonna need 20 squares. I'm using a square paper punch, but you can always make a square template and trace and cut out each square if you don't wanna get a square paper punch. And it helps to lay them all out before you stick them onto the shirt so you know the plan. Once you have all your squares punched out, peel the backing off each one and stick it to your shirt. You can use a ruler if you want to help align all your squares, but it's fairly easy to get them to line up correctly. Just take your time. After all your squares are placed, slip some cardboard in between the front and back of the shirt. I also like to tape off certain areas to make sure that there is definitely no overspray because I don't like overspray. Then take out some spray paint and take your whole operation outside. Give a couple test sprays and then gradually spray the entire front side of the shirt. Let the shirt dry completely, then take it back inside and peel off all your little squares. It's super important that all the little squares are completely dry before you try to peel them off. Otherwise, it's not gonna peel off all the way. And it's super hard to get that sticky residue crap off your fabric. So definitely make sure they're dry all the way before you start peeling them off. You also wanna make sure to give your shirt a good wash before you wear it, because if you wear it without washing it, you're just gonna smell like spray paint and nobody wants that. And if you have any project ideas you want to see on the show, leave a little comment below. Make sure to tune in every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday for new videos. And until next time, snip snip.